I'm pumped for Tim Young's performance later on the show, gang. Carms, who would you who would you want to see from the team perform on the show? Uh, I want to see Krupp. Yes. Krupp. Now explain explain to us who Krupp is. Two of our writers formed a band called Krupp. Tom Trevini. Tom Trevini and, and Nate, Nate Fernald. Fernald. They have a band with the husband of one of our other writers, and then a fourth guy, I think. And they, and they're a band. They really play songs. They have like an EP. And I, they, I want to see them perform on the show. I think we tried to look into this, didn't we, Rob? We tried to book Crub, but they, I think they already booked Kimmel. Yeah, they were already doing another show. <laughs> Hang on. Timing, <laughs> 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 timing. No big deal. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we're good to go. Yeah, so whenever. Yeah, yeah. great. Yeah. 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 Well, uh, uh, okay, okay. We'll remove all the swears from Tom our songs. In case you hadn't figured it out, this is Tom and yeah. Nate. They are the yeah. founding members of Crub. <laughs> <laughs> As long, as long as we can get the time off work, we should be able to make it. Yeah, well, but yeah. hang on, hang on. When you perform on the show, are you going to do it seriously, for real? Like, like it's like it's not a uh, comedy performance, right? No, 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 no. No, it's a serious band. It's a real band. We're yes. serious guys. Well, when do you want to play? Because here's the issue. Ben has already put in the monologue that the next bit should be clean. <laughs> and that means only one thing. There is some movement upstairs. They want to cut this out of the show. So, James, so, here's what you need to do. You need to take your coat off right now so they can't edit this out. If you remove your jacket, <laughs> there will be a continuity issue. I can go one better than that, Nick. <laughs> yeah. All right, well done. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> It's, wait, wait, hang on. There is something out. Forget Crub for a minute. Don't ever do that. But, but <laughs> forget Crub for a minute. When did Freddie Mercury arrive at this show? <laughs> Dale! Dale! You said Dale! Nobody, 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 no. They like, come and me wanna go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're gonna figure it out. Right. It's that time. <laughs> it's time for the news. And Elon Musk is making headlines as word of his latest project has leaked out. Apparently, he is in the process of building his very own city outside Austin, Texas, mostly for employees at his nearby factories. Now, in case part of you is thinking, oh, well, that could be a good idea, I should tell you that Kanye West is also an investor. <laughs> Now, don't worry, citizens of Elon Musk town will be perfectly safe unless the police happen to hear you making any kind of joke at the expense of Elon Musk, and then you'll be in prison. Um, <laughs> Ian, if you were going to build a city from scratch, talk to me about that city, what would it be like? Uh, I think it'd be a lot more like... Kind of like the inside of an airport. Like, it'd be inside of the airport city. There'd be a lot of people movers and then stores where you could buy a sandwich. I like the idea of an airport city. Yeah. I'm often at my happiest in an airport. Don't you love it? Oh, I love it. I'm going somewhere. You're going somewhere? <laughs> I got a scarf on, I got a coffee, there I got are... a bag, I mooch around. I feel, for some reason, an airport, I feel like I've just got unlimited funds. Money's yeah. no object. Oh, should I buy it? <laughs> Here. I'm on a holiday. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You get to the airport the other side, you walk out arrivals, you feel like everyone waiting for their family is paparazzi. <laughs> Do you, ever, do you ever do that? You know, when people are lined up, you walk out like, oh, God, I wish you could just leave me the f alone. <laughs> in other news, the WWE is in talks with state gambling regulators to legalise betting on high-profile wrestling matches, despite the fact that the outcomes are scripted. I can see it now. I see it now. People will be like, oh, really? Yeah, well, if wrestling is fake... Why did the bank just take away my house? <laughs> How weird to be placing a bet on what a bunch of writers came up with somewhere. That would be like, yeah, put $100 on the writers of The Late Late Show showing a picture of something that somehow resembles a penis. <laughs> and finally... 
literally a vegan man in Maine who loves tofu, OK, is appealing to keep his custom licence plate after the state government recalled it for being inappropriate. Now, see if you can tell why. It was clearly a misunderstanding. The man just loves the warm, tender texture and how satisfied it makes him feel afterwards. <laughs> he also loves tofu. <laughs> I actually had a similar situation happen to me. This is true, cos I... You know it's about me. I love going to restaurants. I, I do. It's my favourite thing to do. I love going out to restaurants. But um, when I moved here, for some reason, the state of California... They saw it a completely different way when they rejected this vanity plate. <laughs> and that's the... <laughs> that's the news. You'll be welcome.